Thank you for stopping by the VZ channel. I am in next to Wusong River in Shanghai and today I want to do something a little bit different. So I saw an article the other day which lists the top 20 cities in the world for CCTV cameras. CCTV cameras are those cameras that you see on the street, which are filming the streets and the people, right? So obviously, well, maybe not obvious to some people, 16 out of those 20 cities, cities are in China. Uh, the other four is in India and one of them is in UK, London. Shanghai is also one of these cities. In fact, it has one million cameras. So what I want to do in this video is take one hour I'm going to try my best to count as many cameras as possible within an hour's walk in this area. I'm going to start my timer now and we're only going to do this for one hour, remember. Uh, I'm not going to show you the entire hour because I don't want this video to be an hour or longer. So sometimes I will cut, but I promise I'm doing this for real. So press start. Now let's go to the counting app and when you see one, or zero, right? When I see one, I'm going to add it. So let's go, let's start. All right, immediately I can see some cameras right over there. One, two, three. One, two, three. Let's keep going. And we didn't walk too many steps before we saw more cameras just along this riverside walk. One, two, three. One, two, three here. One, two, three. A little bit of a spoiler, guys. This little walkway, I already know for a fact that every few steps there's going to be three cameras just like that. So we're going to get out of this road in a bit. But for now, yeah, let's just add in, keep adding those one, two, threes. Here we go, another two, three. There are the differently shaped ones. One, two. All right, so we're just about to finish walking along this kind of quiet footpath along the Wusong River. Now we're going to go into the actual city, just uh, going to cross this bridge there, if you can see. Cross this bridge and go into more normal kind of streets and I guarantee there'll be even more cameras there. I see one, two, three. And don't forget, don't forget the building guys as well. The building, there's one watching the door and two next to the other door. One, two. All right, uh, so we saw the traffic light before right the one on the right across the road four on top also have two on the bottom so that's six cameras on just one post let's keep going <laughs> anyway i see some more lampposts in front of me and it has one two three four two watching my way two watching the other way one two three four Okay, see a huge camera in front, uh, on the top. I don't know if you can see it. This is probably the private one which belongs to this building. Another one right by the entrance of this Shanghai Post Museum. walking so let me just show you the clock 14 minutes on the clock is it in focus 14 minutes okay and I got 89 cameras and guys I am 100% certain I didn't catch all of them but I'm trying my best here let's keep going <laughs> Just 
small little street, Khun Shan Khoai Yuan Road. And you would think on small little local streets there would not be too many cameras, but let's have a look. I see one, two, three, four, five. That's what I see so far. Let's keep going. That one's a camera, the small one. Six. Okay, that one looks like a private camera, but still it's a camera. Seven on top there. This is a very traditional uh, housing estate, uh, well, housing block, you would call it. Usually, my friend's telling me it's full of clothes. And you still see some clothes drying up there of the residents. People in China like to dry their clothes outside. <clears throat> Oh, one big one behind, in front of me. So many different shapes and sizes. You might be wondering what do I think of all these cameras. You know, one million cameras in the city, I think it definitely adds to the safety aspect of China in general, right? I mean, if you're a bad guy and they're looking for you, you're fucked. Trust me, you're fucked. They will find you easily. Hiding behind bushes, I see one. Oh, another one looking straight ahead. This, is, this looks like a good one, you can see very far. We're at 149 now. 149. Alright, here's wow, this looks brand new. One, two, three there. Four, five. Alright, two more in front of me. One, two. These look beautiful. I wonder, I wonder how much are these things, by the way? So to equip your city with a million cameras, and some of them are very high tech, you know, with AI and stuff like that. How much does that cost? I would love to know how much does even one cost? All right, one, two in front. Whoa, let's look left for a second. I will count with me. One, two, oh, three, go back four, to this park. five. The cameras don't stop in parks, right? This is where it kind of gets a little bit uh, on the negative side for me personally. You know, if I'm thinking of going to a park, I'm usually imagining peace and quiet and not being watched. No, you are being watched in parks as well. One in front. Yeah, it does kind of like give you a sense of, I am being watched, you know, like every time I go out, there's hundreds of cameras looking at me and I appreciate the safety aspect and all that, but you know, when they go into parks and you're looking for peace and quiet, for me personally, it kind of kills the vibe. All right, one there. Oh, there's more. Two watching the exit. Oh, I'm wrong. Three watching the exit. <laughs> one, two, three. at 40 minutes now 40 minutes and I have I've seen 208 cameras once again I want to reiterate that this is probably not all the cameras that are there this is just the ones I can see while I'm walking with all this equipment as you can see it's not easy filming this kind of video all right so we just made a little circle we're coming back to a different bridge yeah, all this walk is in a very small area, right? We're not going somewhere too far and not walking very fast. All right, let's keep going. So I see one, two, three, four. Alright, so this bridge, in one tiny spot, I counted like uh, 15 cameras. Well, yeah, this bridge, as you can see, many girls come to take professional photos here. And yeah, it's a good location and many nice girls. Anyway, one, two, three cameras.
no jaywalking here in the center. Don't cross the road on the red light in China, guys. In the center, especially. You're gonna get a ticket. Wow, look, so many doing wedding photos, just professional pictures, all kinds of stuff here. One, two, three. Just above me right now, I'm counting. Four. We're at two, four, three now. So, I just want to say that this place right here what you see behind me is nine cameras. All right, I'm gonna pretty much stop it right here at 59 minutes, so almost an hour, 30 seconds to go. And how many cameras have I counted? 270. I don't know, what do you think? Is that a lot? Try and do this in your country, in your hometown, if you're bothered, see how many you get. And just by walking casually, by the way, I'm not like dun 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 dun, you know, rushing to see as many cameras as I can. I was walking casually with my buddy, uh, you know, we're obviously distracted by many other things and uh, we've got backpacks and stuff. And in this short hour, in this small area, we've got 270 cameras. All right. Thank you for watching. Peace.